this is a good segment. Or we're going to do a segment called uh, QYIT Radio. And the conceit of this is that, you know, maybe people have some advice that they are seeking. Mm -hmm. And, mm. Uh, and this, is a, mm. this is a call and advice show. Yeah. And, you know, we are, you know, various NPR radio hosts who speak in mm -hmm. NPR radio host voice. And we just answer them in whatever yes. weird NPR radio host persona you want to have. Mm -hmm. Most of us are definitely the kind of old lady who has like, a, a, a big pot plant in her front garden and is like pretty stoned most of the time, probably. <laughs> <laughs> but wherever your muse takes you, mm -hmm. really. Like it's, uh, and uh, we're going to have some people who we're going to call in. We're going to have some of our comms volunteers call in. And uh, maybe in chat, if you are interested in asking some advice uh, after our comms volunteers have called in, you could put some questions in chat and stuff like that as well. Mm -hmm. uh, we, we aren't set up to pull questions from chat. We aren't? No. Oh. Well, we then... have not prepped the person to do that. Well, we, we just read them. We can yeah, just man. read them. Well, yeah, we can just read them. We'll, yeah. just, we'll, just, we'll just grab ones that we like, chat. Yeah. We'll, mm. we'll grab a few. Yeah. 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 We're on it. Mm -hmm. so, we'll, just, we'll just do it. Yeah. And we're good with it. So, but uh, that's, that's QYIT radio. So we're just going to sit down and uh, give people a little piece of our minds. So mm -hmm. is uh, Victoria going to be a host or a guest? Oh, I think she should be a host. I think so. Yeah. Victoria is very wise. Oh. I, oh, goodness. Very mm -hmm. much. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, do I have a co-host? Am I uh, just the host? It'll be oh. me and Kathleen, I think, will be our co-host. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. Uh, do you want me to lead it in, Kathleen? Yeah, take it. Absolutely. Go, Go ahead, Joe. Hello, and welcome back to QYIT, Quiet Time Radio. Thank you all for joining us again today. It's so good to be back with you. And I have my lovely co-host Kathleen with me today. Kathleen, how are you today? Oh, I'm really wonderful today. I'm having a great day. The sun came up, and I know the sun will go down again. And that brings me hope. Oh, that's so lovely. And we have a special guest host with us today. Victoria, welcome to the show. Thank you so much for having me. I'm so <laughs> excited to be here. Uh, the sun does come up and the sun does go down. And for me, that brings me despair. Oh, oh I can see that. <laughs> mm. uh, so we have a very special guest today. Uh, we want everyone, all, all of our listeners, to take care of their health. So we have somebody providing us with a bit of guidance in some exercise routines that we can do. Um, we have our new fitness correspondent, Mikhail, who is a former Russian Olympian, who is coming in here to lead us through a couple uh, stretching exercises for the day. <sighs> Mikhail, welcome to QYIT Quiet Time Radio. Hello, yes, I am Mikhail. Uh, I am here. Uh, thank you very much for having me. I appreciate it, uh, 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 Erica, Kathleen, uh, the, the wise and great and mighty Victoria Tran. Uh, yes, um, so uh, yes, I, I would like everybody to make sure that uh, they are well stretched, uh, uh, well taken care of, uh, well lubricated, as I have heard is important. Uh, so yes, uh, let's, um, uh, uh, let us, uh, if you do not mind, uh, we shall all uh, stand at our feet. Don't feel like you have to get up, Miss Tran. Uh, <laughs> yes, okay, yes, okay. No, I'm s it's all right. I, I want to channel the energy you are bringing to this room. Ah, oh, fantastic. It's uh, mostly gays. Okay, <laughs> uh, we're going to take our hands here. Uh, we're going to stretch them out. It's good to keep the fingers loose, as my grandmama used to say. Okay, we're going to take our hands and we're going to put them together uh, like, a, uh, like, like a prayer to whatever God you believe in uh, that isn't real. Okay, so push your palms down to the floor as much as you can. You're going to feel the stretch in the uh, outside of your arm stair. It's going to be very nice. Okay, very good. Excellent. Good job. Flip them around. Okay, put the back of your palms there uh, together and then, uh, you know, lift them up as much as you can with, uh, you know, the back of your hands uh, as much as you can. Okay, lift it up. You wiggle your fingers like, uh, 
uh, like the jellyfish that Victoria Tran likes so much. Okay, it's very nice. Okay, good. Okay, shake him out a little gently, not too loud, not too loud. It's quiet time. It's quiet time. That's good. Okay. All right, that's very good. Okay, uh, Miss Tran, just put your arm here because we're going to do leg things. Okay, good. Very good. Okay, take your right leg stick out. Okay. Oh, just spin, uh, spin, spin. Yes, spin ankle. Spin ankle, very good. Okay, spin other way, uh, as if you are churn butter. Okay. Yes, just like we do in old country. Very good. Okay, okay. Get that leg down. That's nice. Okay, other leg. Other leg. Okay, get that leg up. That's nice. That's good. Now, I wouldn't recommend doing this after doing a bunch of indeterminate number of squats. Uh, 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 it might be difficult, but I haven't done that because I'm a different person now. Okay, spin other way. That's nice. Shake out, shake out. That's good. Excellent, very good. That is fitness time. Okay, Brett, sit down. Okay, sit down. Please, for the love of God that does not real, sit down. Okay, hello. Very happy to be here. Mikhail, thank you so much. You're, that was, that, I feel so invigorated now. Uh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Please, uh, can you tell us a little bit about yourself, just so the viewers have a bit of a background? Yes, absolutely. I, I am, I am, I am Mikhail. Uh, that's actually two names. That's my full name. My first name is Mick. My last name is Hale. Uh, I am a fitness instructor. I come from uh, the old country. <laughs> you can pick which one, really, because I, I, that's where I am from. It's my address. That's where you can send me fan mail. Uh, I am about uh, eight foot eleven. Um, I'm not very good with numbers. Thank you so much for coming in. It's my pleasure. Yes. Uh, so we have some guests calling in who would like some advice. Mm. Uh, do we have one of our guests ready uh, with a question? Okay, that's nice. Let's 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 uh, yes. Uh, yes. Mm. Uh, Tim. Uh, what question do you have for us? Oh. Yes. Hello. Hello, caller. Can Can you hear the mm -hmm. team, Miss Tran? Yes. Uh, I no. No. Ah. no. no. Oh. Ah. We seem to be having some connection problems. Yes. Oh, yes, I'm so sorry about that. Is oh, that not the human go. condition? Oh, there he is. Hello. Oh, hello. Ah, yes. Hello. Um, hello. So, so, so nice to be talking with you all today. Uh, it's a lovely, lovely day today. Um, I was wondering if you have any new tea flavors you'd recommend. My repertoire of uh, tea has uh, been a little rote lately, and mm. I would love to find some new, new bold flavors to try and change things up. Mm. Mm. You need to put a little pep into your, well, peppermint, really, I suppose, right? Uh, uh, mm. That's a good one, Kathleen. Oh, yeah. Thank you. Mm. Uh, uh, well, uh, I've, I've, I've heard some suggestions before uh, from from a few blogs, but it's it's been it's been hit and miss. Oh, <laughs> not well, even. Oh. Have you? Oh, oh, go ahead. Oh, all right. Um, my my suggestion for tea as we all know um tea is mainly leaves and hot water and thus why limit yourself to pre-packaged teas why not just go out into the world to your nearest park grab whatever leaves you can and throw them into a pot of boiling water and drink that in that way you can discover the earth and lubricate yourself with Yes. Ah, yes. Very wise. Mm. Oh, the, mm. the gorilla ah. steeping movement. I like that suggestion. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. That's good. Yeah, yes. Good. Gorilla steeping movement guaranteed to cause a movement. <laughs> That's right. Mm. Anarchy now. Exactly. Mm -hmm. It's just hot leaf juice. Yeah. It's hot leaf juice. Just as coffee is hot bean water. So if you would like to just throw random beans into water, mm -hmm. that could be a nice uh, mm. change to yeah. your routine. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Mm. I have been eating a roasted mm. pinto bean what, what, coffee what, what, lately. What? Mm. 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 Uh, yes. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, would, would pinto beans work well for tea? 
Oh, absolutely. Uh, that would be coffee, mm-hmm. I think. Yeah. Well, because it's beans, so mm. it would be coffee and not tea. Mm. Yeah. Mm. You heard it here first. Yes. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, thank you so much for calling in, Tim. Uh, thank you. Our next caller is TQ. TQ, what question do you have for us? Hi there. Can you hear me okay? Oh, we can. Yes, mm-hmm. Hello. Hi. I actually just got into the... Um, haunted doll industry Mm. oh yes Mm -hmm. and i'm having some trouble wrangling them and i was wondering if you had any advice (coughs) they're getting a little out of hand trying to keep them in tow what would you advise on that i i have a lot of experience in this realm now forgive me for you know guessing at your backstory did you buy one haunted doll and then buy another haunted doll to keep the first haunted doll company hoping that would, you know, sort of sort itself out. Mm. I originally bought twins, actually, <gasps> oh. and then got them a friend because they, it was a whole deal. Mm. 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 Yeah. I just mm. know that, you know, once it's, it's, you think you can handle a haunted doll and everything goes very well, but then, you know, it's, it's just an exponential curve of doll-related issues once you're in there. There's mm. eyes everywhere you're going. Mm. There's food going missing. Mm. There's blood dripping from the walls, even mm. when, you know, your landlord's coming by. It's mm. very awkward. It's very awkward. So I totally understand. Oh, I, I've absolutely lost my uh, security deposit. Absolutely. Mm. Oh, yeah. Uh, my mm. advice for haunted dolls is definitely make sure you put uh, a safety lock on the knife drawer. Mm. Uh, that's very a very important first step. Um, otherwise, having a closet that you can lock them in at night mm. is very helpful. Mm-hmm. Yeah, uh, a crate that you can put a blanket over so they, you know. Oh yes, mm. yeah, that helps them sleep. Mm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. I was originally trying free roaming, mm. but yeah. they don't understand the difference between the kitchen and the murder room. That's so oh, common because yes. they smell food in both and they mm. just get confused. Mm. It's so common. Absolutely. It's totally not your fault. I think the only solution to this is to actually get more uh, cursed dolls so that you can have uh, you know, new ones kind of help balance out the energies and um, make sure they aren't lonely together. So just continually buying more should probably fix it. Mm-hmm. Yes. Oh, yes. well, thank you so much for that advice. Mm. Yeah. Yes. Haunted, haunted Dolls haunted Fight doll. Club. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Yes. They're, they're pack animals. Yes. They mm-hmm. need to be together. They yeah, don't, they're they... very social. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yes, mm-hmm. yeah. Mm-hmm. pack animals. Dolls are used to being in boxes. Good advice. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Pack, pack animals. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. Well, TQ, thank you so much for calling us today. We hope we've been able to help you out uh, a little bit with your issues. Mm. Mm. Uh, we wish oh, you the... for sure. Thank you so much for having me. Yes. We yes. wish you the best of luck. Yes. Excellent. Uh, and now we're wondering, we have a couple people in the studio with us as well, oh. uh, if any of them have uh, questions for, our, for us. Yes. Yes. Can we, can we put you on the spot, anyone? Hello, Quiet Time Radio. Hello. And what's your name, caller? Uh, my name is Mike Halbert. Mike, hello. Mm, mm. Hello, hello. And hello to you, Mike Hale. Uh, hello, um, Chris. Nice it's to it's good to hear mic. it's good to hear another mic. Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, my my question uh, to the group mm. is that um, I'm part of a uh, local preservation group. Uh, we are trying to preserve the taupe spotted brown frog. Um, mm-hmm. It's not very good at preserving itself. It's related to a couple other frogs you may have heard on the news. Mm-hmm. Uh, a couple of our other chapters have have. Uh, stoke the flames of um, rebellion and uh, upheaval in order to preserve the frogs. But yeah. in, in my local town, uh, we are struggling to get people on our side. Yeah. Now, yeah. how do you get the people on your side for the amphibians in your life? Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, I find a good pamphlet always mm-hmm. helps. Oh, yeah. I've had good luck sending out pamphlets, oh, yes. uh, uh, handing them out on street corners. I, I find pamphlets. people, pretty much everybody, uh, will want to make eye contact with you and talk to you if you're handing out pamphlets. Mm, mm, mm-hmm. Mm, 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 mm. Yes. I have done this with I my agree. phone number. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, uh, I find uh, signing a petition online 
is always a, mm. a good way to feel like you've done something without actually contributing. I like mm. to do that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, I, I personally love to uh, tweet something out without reading uh, an article attached to it, just so people know that I <laughs> do take it seriously. Oh, yeah. Yeah. yes. Yeah. That's a great mm -hmm. way yes. to no, spread it. No, mm -hmm. no decision like snap decision. Yes. Exactly. Yes. yes. Uh, best, best, mm -hmm. best way to get someone on your side is to get them on their side for some light leaves. Yes. Mm -hmm. yeah. That's that's what uh, Michael uh, thinks. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Oh, thank all of you for those uh, those options for me. I think I'm going to go with Mike's option there because we're both Mike. Mm. Um, uh, and and I trust him. But, uh, yeah. uh, six to one, uh, eight dozen to another. Yeah, 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 exactly, yeah. exactly. Mm. Thank, thank well, you all. I'll, I'll, uh, I'll bring that forth to the committee. Mm. Mm. Thank you. Mm. Um, I think that's uh, almost all the time we have for today. Oh, cool. yes. Do we have anybody else? Who Do we have any know? other? So quickly. Uh, last no, we got nothing. Okay. You... This no. shows always go so quickly. I always let, love spending time with you. Let Let me pull a couple from chat. Oh, for sure. Yes, chat, of course. If you, yes, of if you course, got, of course, yes. chat, if yes. you've got a question. Mm. Mm. Put mm. it in. Mm -hmm. We've got Victoria till three. Uh, so. it's, it's true, yes, uh, if you have questions. Uh, yeah, here's yes. one. I've gotten a job offer Me for a job mm. I am not looking forward to. Oh. What should I do? Um, go into the woods. Just keep going oh. um, until you see no signs of civilization. And just become one with the trees and the rocks. Mm. Mm. That's, that's the only way to live a life. Mm. Yes. Okay. Well, congratulations on getting the job, first mm -hmm. of all. For getting the job offer, um, That's yes. good. I, I am sad that you don't want to do it, but that also means you can take this job, but then keep looking for another job. Yes. Yeah. You don't yes. know these people anything. Mm -hmm. This is true, <laughs> yes. It's you just started working there. Mm. Very good, <laughs> very good, yes. Uh, any, any, any advice there? Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes, as l I feel yeah. like as yeah. long as you put in your best effort and uh, it will work out. It It is inevitable that it will work out. Everything mm -hmm. will turn out fine because you cannot escape your destiny of everything going well and you succeeding. Mm. Yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's true. Mm -hmm. You are born under a very intense star. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. It's fair. It's burning so brightly. I actually uh, have to buy some sunglasses because yeah. Your future is so bright, it is blinding me. Oh, yeah. absolutely. Yeah. You're going to want to get those moles mm -hmm. looked at, though. Because of that. <laughs> <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> sunscreen. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Please wear sunscreen. Yes. <laughs> yes. If you want at to least look 30 at SPF. <laughs> yeah. mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. If you want to look at moles, get good shovel, as Grandma always said. Oh, yes. 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 Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Here's another question. I bought too many board games and now I'm trapped under them. Which oh. one should I eat first to survive? Candyland. <laughs> <laughs> mm. That's, Mikhail, you're so wise. I always love having you on the show. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <gasps> oh. It seems you have also grown your, your brain muscles in addition to your bicep muscles. No, no, no. I was for head empty. It's Mikhail's. <laughs> Uh, motto. <laughs> yes. Ah, yes. oh, it strengthens that you think with your stomach, though. Mm -hmm. So you know, instinctually. Yeah. Yes, mm -hmm. it, 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 that's how you have to work yeah. out the abs. If, oh yes. right, yes. Yes. Yeah. Right. I didn't get this one pack for nothing, you know. <laughs> if you uh, are not the kind of person to eat dessert first, which I have no judgment for you if you do, but if you prefer something savory first, uh, sushi go would be the game I would eat first. Oh, mm. Mm. yeah, mm. settle the stomach. Very mm. good, yeah, a nice light yeah. meal. Yeah. You like board game? Mm. Or game uh, board if you see one? Yes, I, oh, it's looking at I, I, I do enjoy a good board game. Uh, mm. However, because my head is actually a screen, I am more particular towards video games. Ah, uh, it's oh, it, yes. it, 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 smart, yes. Mm -hmm. yes. Mm -hmm. you, you have favorite yes. video game? Yes, which would you eat first to survive? Mm. <laughs> oh, uh, oh no. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe burger time? 
<laughs> oh yes, uh, I would I would eat uh, the game Among Us first so that I... I can take a nap and no longer have to work. Mm. Mm. Ah. Oh, that's I hear very smart. I hear one have to be careful because sometimes you get imposter in that empty calories. Yes. Yes, it is very unfortunate, mm. but it is a risk I am willing to take. Uh, that's very good. That's mm. nice. That's very good. Yes. Yes. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Way to vent the knowledge. <laughs> 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 oh, yes, of course. <laughs> we have, we have, if you have a question for us in chat, we are all very, very smart and very wise mm -hmm. and uh, clearly capable of giving you important life advice. Absolutely. Yes. So put them in chat yeah. and, uh, oh, here's a good question. Yes. Because we, you know, we're experts with animals and dolls. Mm -hmm. ah. Which makes a better pet, a raccoon or a possum? Oh, that's such a good question. We get that one quite often, yeah, in fact. It's, but it's, you know, it's a question you have to ask yourself every time, a, you know, a kid's birthday comes up. Is this the year we get the family possum and or is this the year we get the family raccoon? Oh, mm. yeah. It really comes raccoon. down to what your family, oh. the mm. needs of your family and how much attention you can give it. Mm -hmm. um, oh. Raccoons are very self-sufficient, much like a cat. Mm. Um, uh, they yes. can go, they can feed themselves. Um, that you can litter train them. It's not easy, but it is possible. It's usually best if you just walk them. But they will also clean their own food, which is a big advantage. Oh, yes, yes, Possums yes, yes. require mm. more care, similar to, say, a dog. You have to pay more attention to them, but they can be very loving and loyal companions. Mm -hmm. uh. Yeah. Mm. A raccoon can steal things for you, though. That's a big bonus. Yes, yes, yes. absolutely. Yes. 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 Exactly. You you say raccoon. Mm -hmm. Why why you say raccoon? Yes. Uh, I just admire the way that they've just, you know, um, mastered being trash monsters. Mm -hmm. you know, I mm -hmm. highly yes. mm -hmm. uh, connect with that. Mm -hmm. You know, being one with the trash. So, mm -hmm. for me, it's always uh, going to be the raccoon. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm. Yes. Did you grow up in a raccoon household or a possum household, Mikhail? Oh, we had a we we had a, a rack docking. We had a possum in a raccoon. Oh. Yes. What a misfortune you mm. must have grown up with. No, no, no. Is is like a uh, like a genetic matryoshka, except they don't come apart easy. Okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm. yes. Yeah. Mm. The old, I always love learning about the old country. It's so fascinating. A very old. Yes. Mm. Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. yes. I, I mean, I do like possum because, you know, sometimes you go like, bah, and then they, they play dead, and then if you ignore it enough, uh, it, it be dead. So either way, you win. Mm. I always find if you ignore them enough, they just start biting you with, with possums. Oh, yeah. we, we call that old country massage. Oh. Mm. Oh. How nice. Not That's really. So <laughs> mm. But thank you for thinking so. Yes. Um, yes. Mm. Oh. So, Chad, if you have any questions, just throw them in there. We'll try. We'll try to read them out, mm -hmm. or not. Maybe we'll just make up some other questions of our own. But uh, uh -huh. some other questions that I've seen go questions. by is yes. that if you were born under this is this is a riff on a question I have read. So, uh. I was born under the sign of Aries, and. Oh no. You know, do you have any mm. astrological advice for me coming up in the in the year? And I just feel like I just know so much about astrology that I, that we'd just be experts at doing it. So uh, mm, absolutely. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Victoria, mm. do you know much about astrology? <laughs> um, I I can say that I I have seen at least one star oh. in my lifetime oh. Oh. thus i think i am an expert at this yes, yes, yes. Uh, i too was born under the sign of aries oh. which makes me very energetic and aggressive i think oh. um oh. and that's all i care about my sign so if there's any other sign out there i don't believe uh, that it exists so i think everyone is an aries and oh we should be doing squats. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah. Oh. 
<laughs> very good, yes. very good. Yes. Um, I like that, I like that <laughs> worldview. Mm. Yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. I saw this sign. It opened up my eyes once. Mm. Mm. I didn't like that M. Night Shyamalan movie. <laughs> no, 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 no. I am not a big fan of M. Night Shyamalan. <laughs> Oh, I love the ShamWow. It was really great at uh, picking up some spills. That's oh, true, yes. yes. Mm -hmm. I had to use the ShamWow after mm -hmm. I used the slide job. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I, that buzz got everywhere. Yeah. <sighs> yes. Are we yeah. all Aries here? I we, so. we are now. I believe yes. we are now. Yeah. I, yeah. You've convinced yes. us. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes. I, mm -hmm. I, I will have to go I down. I think Erica would have some good knowledge due to the dress. Oh, yes, thank you. Uh, um, yes. I find that a lot of times, uh, for any advice for stars, is to uh, focus on your relationships, either at work or at home, mm. or in your personal life, or friendships. Mm. Pretty much just, it's very easy to just... Uh, to give advice that focuses on quite broad aspects. Everybody goes to work or school and therefore gives face challenges. Uh. Mm. Consider those. That's right. Mm. Mm -hmm. mm. Yeah. Yes. Mm. Well, uh, That's lovely. I have to go. You okay. Have, you have Thank you. Go. Thank you for having mm. me. Thank you so much. Very much. Yes. Mm -hmm. it, is, it has been nice to be here. Uh, thank you very much for having me, uh, ladies, and uh, remember, uh, God isn't real. <laughs> okay, I will see you in four or six or eight thank days, you. whichever one is it. Oh, yes. Thank you okay. so thank you. much. Mikhail always speaks like a man who's really seen things to come to his beliefs, you know? I, I, I believe so. I yeah. always appreciate his perspective mm -hmm. on life. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, I feel like he, he he's working uh, with galaxy brain knowledge with all of the stellar advice mm. absolutely mm. absolutely mm. well thank you all so much for joining us today on quiet time radio uh we wish you all a soft and pleasant day and try try not to take it too hard out there uh, have a good night bye everybody good night, good night everyone